Hey everybody, Mark Ignesi here in the back room of Norman's Rear Guitars. Welcome back to the final guitar of the day for the week. Woo! Oh, it's also the final guitar of the day for me for a while here. Um, don't, don't freak out. It's a Jen, it's her birthday next week. We know how much Jen loves to live her best life. So she's taking a week off. She's going <laughs> to Mexico, a bunch of people. So all next week will be pre-filmed episodes. Don't worry, it's all new content. Don't worry, don't get your panties in a bunch. It's gonna be fine. But that means I'm done for like the next 10 days. I got nothing. Jen's going to Mexico uh, tonight. Going to see my boys, the Struts, down at the House of Blues in Anaheim. Uh, their record just came out this week. Very happy to go catch up with the boys. Haven't seen them in a few months. I'm gonna have some fun times tonight. It's freaking Stratter Day. Woo! We had a good run, guys. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Also, because Jen won't be here next week, unfortunately, we're gonna be taking a week off from our giveaway because we've already filmed the episode. You didn't win, homie. All right, sorry to break it to you. <laughs> you didn't win. Um, but uh, when we get back, you guys will submit all of those set lists and we'll, we'll pick one when she gets back from her trip uh, in the following week. It's been a while since we've done some hipster stuff. This is, I mean, this is that. Come on back. This is from 1979. This is like one of the very last Fender Jazzmasters original Sienna Sunburst finish with black plastic parts, binding and blocks on the neck, and the original plastic molded Jazzmaster case. Wow. Oh, like every hipster in Silver Lake in Brooklyn just cream their jeans right now. <laughs> so ugly, it's so rad. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> it's pretty cool though. I kind of like it. I'm a hipster. I mean, let's just look at this finish for a second, because it's like, goes to this, it's like a poopy brown sunburst almost. Can we turn it around again? Right there. Oh yeah. But very cool. Jazz Masters start 1958, they go through 1980. This is one of the latest ones I've ever seen. This is the first time I've actually ever seen uh, like the molded style case for a Jazzmaster. They must have only made this literally for like one or two years in this case. Um, but the guitar, fantastically clean, man. Um, this is one another one that Norm picked up at the show. When he sees stuff this clean, he doesn't care what color it is, what era it's from, he's buying it. I don't blame him. I mean, come on, look at that thing. Um, binding in the block starts uh, in 66, goes all the way through the rest of the 60s and into the 70s, kind of a trademark of the CBS era of production. Um, by this point, later in the 70s, we switched to the black plastic parts on all of these things, um, but it still has all kind of the same appointments. We have the rhythm and lead circuit here, rhythm circuit, just neck pickup with the cap, volume and tone on the wheels. Down is going to be the lead circuit, brings us down to the three-way switch for bridge, both, or neck, master volume, master tone, down here. We haven't had a jazz master in a while. It's freaking Stratter Day, but you guys, you're so bored of those minty 55 ash body strats and those minty 58s. Ah. <laughs> Let's do a Sienna Sunburst 79 jazz master instead. Why not? Let's call it a week. Let's call it a week off for both of us from this. Let's go get it done. All right, we're out front. We have the 1979 Fender Jazzmaster original Sienna Sunburst finish, black plastic parts, binding and blocks on the neck. Uh, we're going through the uh, hand-wired deluxe reverb again today, all EQs at noon. Just a little bit of reverb. Volume on the amps on about four. We're gonna bypass the uh, rhythm circuit right now. We're just down the lead circuit. Let's hear these pickups. We're gonna start up here on the neck pickups. Here we got.
collision. Both of those pickups working together. Let's see what we got there. Bridge pickup, wide freaking open all by itself. Let's kick the amp up to about five there. See what that bridge can do. It's one of the very last of the Fender Jazz Masters. This one is about as clean as you can possibly freaking imagine. Original Sienna sunburst finish, black plastic parts, binding and blocks on the neck. Original molded plastic Jazz Master case. I mean, we're talking, they only made that for like one year maybe. And it's like that one. Never seen another one like that. There it is, man. Another week of Guitar of the Day. Uh, Jen's out next week. Everything's going to be pre-filmed, so don't send in any set list this week. But there will be a brand new episode every day next week. Don't worry. And then we'll be back with real-time episodes when Jen returns. But there's another week of Guitar of the Day. Thanks for checking it out. I'm Mark Agdesi. Follow the store at, at Norman's Rare Guitars. Check this and the rest of these guitars out online at normansrareguitars.com. And we'll see you back here on Tuesday. You guys have a great weekend. Peace. Bye. Peace.